Alrighty guys, so um this is gonna be on the Conad nail stamping and you guys were wondering how I did um like zebra print and leopard print on my nails and it looks complicated but it is so easy. You guys just have to know, you know. And then I also have I don't know if you guys can see, I have the crackle nail polish on and as you can see the acrylic has grown a lot. I really need to get my nails done again. And I also uh, filed them down because they got very long. You guys see, it's uh, kind of messy doing this. And yes, and so my nails are very ugly right now. But anyway, so this is the Conad um, plate. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but um, yeah, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it has like the designs and stuff on it see it it's kinda hard you know but <clears throat> they has like zebra print right here uh, leopard print right here um, like fishnet right here which looks really cool and then right here is like two little french tip things um, this one has some leopard print on it and this is M57 and flowers over here too and as you guys can see it's not very big it's a very small one I only paid $3.99 so hey I'm not gonna complain second you're gonna need <clears throat> the Conad special nail polish also going back on the name the design plates um, they go for $6.99 and the ones for $6.99 are like that big but it comes with the same exact stuff on here this nail polish runs for $6.99. I got it on Amazon for a little cheaper. I'm not sure how much. I think maybe $6. It's actually $6.99 though. And you guys can see it has a pretty butterfly on it. But um, as you can see, it's a very thick nail polish. Very messy. I got black because black you can put on top of anything. And I wasn't looking on spending a lot of money. And then for like $3.99, you get the nail scraper, which is like almost like a razor blade to scrape off the excess. And then the stamp. And this was $4.99 for both. And as you can see, it's it's like a rubber, um, I don't know how to explain it, but it's a rubber stamp. And it's this pink, like hot pink part is all rubber, which is good because then it gets in all of the little designs on here and stuff and it gets in there and gets color so first off you're gonna need a tissue as well and also this is NYC NYC a old white I have and sinful colors just if you guys wanted to know and I'm gonna start off with um, excuse me I think I'm gonna sneeze Oh, yes, I okay. Ugh, excuse me. And so, you want to put like a thick coat on the zebra. And now you're going to take your uh, thingy scraper, scrape off the excess. You want to push kind of hard, and you guys see how much goes to waste a lot. And so, then we have that. And then now you're going in with the stamp onto it. And you guys see the design. It didn't pick it all up very well. And I'm just going to put it on the white. And you guys see how crappy my nails are, so I'm doing it on the paper for you. And you guys see how it comes out, you know? You see that. Now I'm just going to go and do the leopard print. <coughs> Excuse me. And you guys saw how I put the nail polish on. As you can see, nail polish is on. Scraping it right now. This, this. And you see the design on there. I'm going to put it on here. And you guys see how that comes out. The design on it. The zebra came out kind of ugly. Okay, now I'm going to go in to the fishnet looking one. 
And you guys wanna put a thick amount on on these uh designs, you know? And you don't wanna keep scraping too much. You've kinda gotta move quickly with these. And let me just see. And you guys wanna push pretty hard, like you see? There's the design. And there it is on there. And like as if that was your nail, you know? Like, hey, my nail. And also when you're doing these, especially on your nails, um, like these, they don't fit my nail all the way, so it doesn't look right. And like when I stamp it, it gets on my skin, which you guys can easily remove it with like a Q-tip or whatever, you know? So don't be like little babies, like, oh my god, it's so messy. Hey, you want cool looking nails? You want to tell the world, hey, look what I did by myself? Then, hey, don't complain, you know? And then scrape now I'm doing the flowers and I had to scrape twice and I'm gonna go here see the flowers they didn't come out right I'm just doing it right there but you guys see that flower came up the best and if you guys can see you know now um I took just my any old top coat that you have um I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys you saw how long this one you know it's been pretty long since uh, that was the first one we did and I'm taking a very thick amount which you guys want to do with your top coats unless you have the top coat and if you guys can see I'm lightly going over it and here's a close up it kind of smears it um, I'm going to go over the leopard print now and what I usually do is I take it and I let it drip over the design and everything. And then I lightly go over it. Which is actually turning out a lot nicer on the paper. Which kind of sucks. <laughs> but as you guys can see, it kind of smears. It co it darkens the color of whatever color you had. Oh, this one's a perfect example. Alright. Like, the color was hot pink. It turned kind of purpley. Um, because the black is now mixed in with it. And so, now for cleanup, you guys see how messy it is. See how messy it got on my hands. This is just a nail polish remover pad thing. And it's so easy to clean up. You know? I don't know if you guys complain. And there, it's nice and clean. It doesn't have to be perfectly clean. You know, and it's a metal plate. This cone out on the back there. You see how messy it gets? It's so messy. And then you definitely want to clean this because you see how messy that gets. It doesn't get perfectly clean. But clean enough. And then here you definitely want to clean. And then that's pretty much it. And that's how you get your cool designs. And I'll do a next video on the crackle nail polish, which is how you get this look. And if you guys like it, you know, if you guys want any more videos, any more designs, like not doing this, but like, you know, cool designs, let me know. And, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll try to do it for you. And I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe, comment, do whatever you guys like. And I'll talk to you guys later.